Good evening, folks. So, uh, I was going over the Antonio de Mule's case. And I decided to look up Adam Mackey's uh, criminal history because I'm sorry, but, you know, barring like every single thing that he's ever done being only a first offense. And even then, I cannot understand how he has not been charged with this crime. So, being the little whiz that I am, and uh, actually uh, a fan also helped out with this, I wanted to, and you know, by the way, thanks sweetie, you're such a fucking help. Um, <laughs> Other people would hear me say that to a fan and be like, oh my God, you just swore at your fan. And my fans are like, yeah, and. <coughs> so uh, a fan sent this to me and I got to say, folks, this is some juicy shit. Oh my God. How the fuck is this man walking around and enjoying himself and getting protected by the police evidently? Like, I don't, I don't understand it. I don't get it. This shit, the earliest on this, on this specific record, is 2003. We've got consumption under the age of 21, guilty. Attempt, attempted motor vehicle use without consent, which, you know, in case you guys are not aware, that's Grand Theft Auto. Convicted. Minoring, uh, consume, consuming alcohol, guilty. Fourth degree DWI. Guilty, traffic, speeding, exceeding limit of 55, convicted, traffic regulation, seatbelt, required drivers and passengers must use, blah, 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 convicted, uh, driver's license, uh, suspended driver's license and driving after suspension, convicted, those are from 2010. Uh, driving after suspension, convicted, that's 2012. Uninsured vehicle, that's 2012 again. Driving after suspension, 2012 again, and convicted. Driver must carry proof of insurance, convicted, 2012. Expired registration, 2012, convicted again. Uh, another... Conviction, uh, traffic violation in 2013, 2014, uh, petty traffic downtown, also convicted. <coughs> in 2005, underage consumption. Clearly, he's got a drinking problem. Clearly, he has a problem of drinking while fucking driving. Clearly, he has no issues going over the speed limit. And these asshats want people to believe that this asshole who has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 convictions for traffic-related bullshit they want us to believe that he was going 28 to 33 miles an hour on a on a rural road. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but um Asante Sheriff's Department, how old would you say I am? I'm 34. Now that we've established that I wasn't born yesterday, can we move along? Yeah? Okay. Folks, uh, last night I said that this was a residential road. It's, it's actually not. There's some areas on this road that are residential. It's actually a rural road. And the speed limit on that road is 55. There is no way Adam Mackey was going 28 to 33 miles an hour and did that kind of damage to Antonio. 
And I forgot to mention that Antonio was dragged about mm, 200 feet, which I'm sorry, but if you just ran over him, generally doesn't happen. Like if your tires just went over a dog, no, that was a full on hit. And no charges are being brought? Is he the DA's illegitimate child? What about the sheriff? Who's he related to? Because this is some suspicious shit, folks. Now, I'm going to go ahead and post a picture of this on my Facebook fan page so you can take a look for yourself. And I've got some even more juicy shit to come out with on this case. I'll probably do some more videos on this tomorrow. Do not forget to go to Facebook. I'll leave the link down below. Go to the Justice for Antonio DeMule's Facebook page. Like the page. Check out the page. Uh, I will also leave the petition down in the description. Sign it. Share it. A 15-year-old child. <sighs> he deserves justice. Because today, it's Antonio DeMule's. Tomorrow, it's your child. Thank you all very much for watching. We'll see you soon.